It is another beautiful morning here in the land down under Gold Coast. And I found my way to Broad Beach. And the sun's actually been up for the better part of an hour. But I thought I would uh, bring you along for a little walk and talk here as I start my day. I've got my, uh, got my morning cup of coffee. Got my headphone on. Got uh, Geraldo Rivera podcast and uh, looks like it's gonna be a nice day look at this this is uh, Broad Beach you see there's a couple just over there they got their dogs come down maybe their breakfast they watch the watch the Sun come up looks like there's a photo session going on over there in the in the distance so I'm just gonna walk and talk and uh, do 30 minutes up the beach in 30 minutes back down the beach and I always have to remember where it is that I uh, that I start my trip so that's my that's my landmark right there so I always got to figure out where's my landmark because elsewise I'll be walking up and down the the beach looking for where I parked my car but uh, boy it's a nice morning I see there's a lot of surfers out there on the water a lot of times you'll come out here and they're doing uh, lifeguard training they'll have young people out on the water training training them to to be lifeguards and it wouldn't surprise me if this isn't uh, what this is right here. Not much of a surf today. You may come down from one day to the next and you don't know what type of a uh, you don't know what type of a surf you're gonna get. You just see some surf uh, I don't know if these are surfboards or kayaks. They look like look like some type of a of a kayak right there. There goes the uh, there goes the surf rescue. You see these guys going up and down the beach with their jet ski behind them. But uh, here they come. You see they're all they're all rowing in. There's probably about a probably about a dozen of them. They're rowing in here on this Saturday morning. There actually are some pretty good. Uh, there actually are some pretty good waves out there. I see some people kind of getting uh, a little bit demolished. Now I don't know that these are. I don't think these are surf guard uh, trainees. I think these are people that are. Oh boy, this over here. The water is actually rather warm, you know, and this is just the the beginning of summertime. So I would imagine that the uh, I'd imagine that this water is going to get really, really warm as the summer summer heats up. But, uh, it's actually some pretty good sized waves coming in all of a sudden. There's somebody kind of lost their lost their boat right there, you see. I kinda lost it. Here he comes. Here he comes to grab it. Alright. Look at that. So there must be some type of a uh, must be some type of a class. And I guess they're going back out. There they go, they're, they're all getting ready to go right on back out into the water. And they're going out in, in unison. Yeah. Oh, this water feels good. This water feels really, really good. Right, there they go. And uh, off I go. 
as you can see, it's not about surfing for uh, for everybody. This guy is uh, got a rather big big line out there. I think he lost his uh, I think he lost his bait, but uh, look at him. So, oh goodness, how are you? Are the fish biting today? Are the fish biting? You got one fish? Okay, is it a big one? Okay, sounds good. Good, have a nice day. All right, you know, I heard of. I'm sorry. I, I'm a, I'm a, from America. Where are you from? Oh, I come from Greece, but I live very long here. Where Where do you come from? I come from Greece. Where? Greece. Greece. Ah, you're from Greece. Yeah. Okay, very very nice. I come to sixteen. Greece. Are there any nice Greek restaurants in Surfers Paradise? Get myself some baklava. Oh, no, baklava. You have, to come to <laughs> have a nice day. Okay. All right. All right. Have a nice day. <laughs> oh goodness! What a wonderful, uh, what a wonderful man there. Here he goes, casting it back out, back out into the surf. Oh, this is a wonderful way to start your day, that is for sure. As I walk along, I just as much finding myself looking at the buildings as I am out to the out to the surf. Look at these buildings here on the Gold Coast. People up there probably waking up on a Saturday morning, looking out over the out over the beautiful Pacific Ocean, and. Uh, they don't need to go very far to watch the uh, sunrise. I'd imagine a fair amount of them probably watch the sunrise from their bed. But uh, not all of us have that luxury. So I'm probably almost 30 minutes into my walk. And we'll, uh, I don't know if I'm going to make it down the Surfer's Paradise Beach. I may. We will see as the saying goes. I'm getting closer. To Surfers Paradise Beach and the activity certainly picking up up on this part of the beach here and as I pan up here you see one of the big attractions here at uh, Surfers Paradise on the cold uh, Gold Coast it's this tower and I actually did a video from that that tower there I think I had a hamburger up on the uh, up on the observation deck. Here's some young folks here that are getting ready for uh, some fun in the water. The, uh... Very nice. I'm actually looking now. Here is a. I think this is a. A surf. This would be a lifeguard just up here, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, I see some flags. They'll put out flags, and I don't quite know what the flags mean. But more times than not, I'll see these yellow and yellow and orange flags. It looks like they're getting ready to put those up. There's a flag right here. Let's see, checkered, checkered flag. So they're just setting up for the day. It looks like. Let's see, they've got their light guy, lifeguard stand right there. And just up here, they have their their boats. See, they're just setting up for the day here, putting out their chairs and getting all their signs out. And up here they have some some boats that looks like they're getting ready to take them into the water. 
North Cliff SLSC Surf, Jim Burgess Rescue. So, you don't necessarily want to find yourself sitting in one of these, or lying in one of these. There's your, there's your boat. And there they go off into the, off into the water. All right. So as they say in the, uh, as they say in the military, I'm going to do myself a, an about face, which is turn around and uh, start walking, start walking back. I'm going to ask these guys for a ride. Uh, let's head back. This is actually a training area that you see. You see the, the signs, so they're going to be doing some, some training here. I have found my way back to my uh, landmark right, uh, right there. And it's a little bit before 7.30 in the morning. I've walked the better part of an hour down and back up the back up the beach and here at 7 30 now that's something you don't see too often somebody with a uh with a starbucks cup you don't see uh you don't see starbucks cups all that often there must be a starbucks somewhere near here but anyway so the activity is certainly picking up on the beach and they will have the lifeguards will be out here shortly setting up designated swimming areas and I'm gonna see if I can't go down and find myself a wetsuit and do a little maybe do a little body surf and get 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 in the water. So I hope you enjoyed this this morning walk and talk. Should give you give a shout out to to Molly and uh, and her husband down in Texas. Molly was sweet enough to send me a message that her and her husband just really enjoy watching my uh, watching my videos from the land down under. And there's a young lady. Her dad is just sending her off into the into the surf. So. Oh, it's going to be a beautiful day. Another beautiful, beautiful day. There's another father here with his two little, two little ones here. Perhaps debating just how far they're going to walk into the, uh, walk into the water. Yeah. All right, folks. Have a, uh, have a great day. There's mom watching the stuff here. Alright, have a wonderful, wonderful day. You know, maybe I wrapped up the video just a little bit early in that I could have and decided to share this with you. The Karawa Surf Life Saving Club. So you'll see these, you'll see these clubs all over Australia, these various surf clubs. And I don't know if you, you join, I would imagine if it's a club, you join the club. But you come down here and I think get yourself some coffee and maybe a bicky for brekkie if you don't go to Maccas, you know. <laughs> Maccas is a word that I learned last night and Macca's is the the nickname for McDonald's what we would call Mickey D's so we might call a McDonald's Mickey D's but down here they'd actually call McDonald's Macca's you see there they all getting their morning uh, morning Java and what have you so wonderful way to start the day. This is actually a, a holiday weekend here in Australia. 
I'm not mistaken, it is uh, Queen's Day on Monday. Long live the, long live the Queen. And I'm coming here on the Robert Gattenby Boardwalk, which is right here. So just a beautiful park. Got a beautiful park and look at that. Well, I would imagine that for those people that have been following me now for seven months, you just uh, really have a good sense of what life is like in Australia. You know, oftentimes you'll see all the, the tourist stuff, but uh, you know, my several months of, of vlogging have really given you some uh, really good perspective on this uh, on this place. And here is a uh, as good a spot as I need to wrap up the, the video. Look at that. All right. So have a uh, have a great day. Thank you.